Hi, in the current comic book that I'm drawing, written by Adrian Brown, uh, it's going to be in the Armed Forces comic book I do, there's a character who is horribly disfigured and then go, becomes a villain. Now, this is a regular trope in comic books. People are like, oh, and not necessarily always villains, but getting horribly disfigured and then uh, it being a life-changing experience and wearing a mask to do whatever it is they're going to do, whether it's being a villain or being a hero. Uh, to just name a few. So, so like Destro from G.I. Joe, he has this mask that's very masculine, uh, you know, have these you know, very strong features. And then you've got people like uh, Cobra Commander, who has a f almost faceless uh, mask. Um, same with Snake Eyes. Uh, and there's um, loads of characters. Uh, the Dark Man. All these things. It's a regular trope in comics. But I wanted to do something different uh, for the mask. Or his, when I, whilst doing his character design, I was looking into things. And I was thinking, okay... Being disfigured and wanting to wear a mask, uh, being that concerned about your uh, your appearance, uh, has feminine qualities to it. It's uh, you know, traits of femininity. Not not a bad thing. It's just, it's just a thing. And so I was looking at what sort of mask he would wear, and I thought maybe if whilst he was in hospital, he was inspired by um, Renaissance sculptures like. Uh, Leonardo da Vinci's Statue of David, which is this rather masculine looking statue, you know, very powerful physique, big hands, strong arms, but has this very angelic, almost feminine looking face. Um, he, he might be inspired and go, right, I'll, I want to look beautiful again because I'm horribly disfigured. I will wear a mask, almost like the Statue of David, where it's very clearly male, but has... Feminine traits like uh, big lips, a soft featured nose, smooth, you know, hair, uh, an, an element of femininity. And so when I designed this character, um, he, he, where he, where, it's meant to be a metal mask. Um, but, uh, he has sort of soft, it's a soft featured metal mask there so uh let me know what you think in the comments about my character design is it original uh does it work well do, do, does this character have villainous qualities despite having <laughs> angelic lips and so on let me know cheers thanks for watching